Hi everyone, this is Dave, and in today's video, Sonnet very kindly sent me their Echo 15 Plus Thunderbolt 2 dock, so I could share my opinion with you. Now, this is a superb piece of kit. This box of tricks allows you to connect all of your peripherals into the various ports, and then with a single Thunderbolt cable, you can connect your laptop and gain access to all of those connected peripherals. It offers a 4K workflow support too, all this through this one box of tricks. It's absolutely fantastic. Now you'll have noticed of late, a lot of manufacturers are actually getting rid of the optical drives on their computers, especially when it comes to laptops and ultrabooks. They want to give you a thinner design, a lighter design, less power draw, etc. Well here, we've got an optical drive. So we gain access to being able to use CDs and DVDs inside the optical drive. And this supports Blu-rays as well. It's got a rugged aluminium design. Not only does it look great, but it also helps dissipate the heat as well. And there's multiple ports. So let's take a look at the ports now. We've got the front panel showing. We've got a couple of super speed USB 3 ports. These also support charging as well as data. They're rated at 1.5 amps each. We've got headphone output, microphone input, and a couple of LED activity lights. One's for power, the other one's for hard drive activity. And I'll tell you why that's there in a short while. Here's the side profile of the Echo 15 Plus. Really nice, I, I just love the design on this. And then round on the back, we've got even more ports. So if we look on the left hand side here, we've got an audio input and also speaker ports on the side. We've got a little tiny fan, which is very, very quiet in operation. And then we've got two Thunderbolt 2 ports. Now the first one you're gonna use for connecting your laptop. The second one you can use for connecting an external display. And then if that external display has got uh, another port on it, you can obviously daisy chain extra Thunderbolt supported devices. This is really nice. This one here is a Firewire 800 port. It's a long time since I've seen one of these, but I used to do a lot of my video editing onto external Firewire 800 hard drives. This adds back that legacy support for that type of drive. We've also got an Ethernet port. Uh, really nice to see this gigabit speed through this Ethernet port. You connect this to your network or to the outside world, and then when you've got your laptop connected in via Thunderbolt, it's instantly connected to your internet connectivity. We've got a couple of eSATA ports here as well. Uh, these support up to six gigabits per second. And then we've got another two high-speed USB 3 ports. Again, these support charging and are both rated at 1.5 amps. And then last but not least, we've got the input for the power supply, which is included in the box. Also included inside the box is a very long Thunderbolt cable. And this is gonna make it very, very easy for positioning this exactly where you want it. Now I mentioned on the front of the Echo 15 Plus, we've got an activity light here for hard drive activity. There is extra space inside this box for mounting a single three and a half inch serial ATA hard drive or two two and a half inch solid state drives with amazing data throughput up to 750 megabytes per second. I think that's a really great additional feature because it means you can put extra storage in here and again, gain access to it via your connected computer. This is really a powerful all-in-one docking solution. It's compatible with every Thunderbolt Mac. In fact, it supports any Mac with a Thunderbolt port running OS 10.9.5 or later. It's also Windows compatible, so it supports Thunderbolt 2 PCs running Windows 10, 8 or Windows 7. I think this is a really great solution. It's fantastically built, very, very solid build quality. And the ease of use and the, the flexibility of something like this means you can connect all of your peripherals and have internal storage, and then with a single cable, connect your laptop and you're ready to go. So that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll leave links to where you can find this product down in the video description. If you enjoyed the video, as always, please do hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you in another video very soon.